you know what? I'm not even tired no more. I'm about to just watch TV. No, no, no. We're going to talk about this. Why can't I sleep on my favorite side of the bed? It's my favorite side. Because I'm the man. You're not the man. The man's supposed to sleep by the door. Why? Because we're the man. Just in case somebody rob us, who going to take care of that? Boy, I always sleep on this side of the bed, okay? My hair needs to be wrapped a certain direction, and this is my side. I always sleep on that side. So. Hold up. You doing this for your hair? So? No, we need a third opinion. Come on. Call my mans. Yeah, what's up? Yo, I need a third opinion. Yeah, what's up? Should a man or a woman sleep next to the door? Well, if the woman respects the man, then the man should sleep next to the door just in case a robber or somebody breaks in um, and threatens them. He can be there in between to protect her. So, the man. Exactly. He said if I respect you, okay? And that's debatable. You don't respect me? You had to call somebody else for their opinion. Like, boy bar. It's an opinion. You're supposed to listen to it. And it's another man talking. Okay, well sleep on your side by yourself. Bet. Babe, are you cooking? Of course. Oh, you're so sweet. I can't believe you cooking for me. Anything for you. <laughs> Hold on, are you using the air fryer? Uh, yeah. Babe, how are you cooking for me using the air fryer? Everybody in 2023 uses an air fryer. Yeah, but that's not cooking with love and effort. Huh, no wonder why you take eight hours to cook. You know what? I need a third opinion because this is very ghetto. Oh, so now you want to call? Mm-hmm. Hey, what's up? Hey, I need a third opinion. Okay. Is it cooking if he's using an air fryer instead of using the stove? Well, have you eaten the food before? No. Yes, you have. Are you serious? Mm-hmm, all the time. You see what I'm saying? Okay, well, I mean, technically it is cooking. However, if you have a loving relationship, like what I believe that you guys have, um, it is more loving to take the time to cut the food, to prepare the food, and actually cook it on the stove, though. Boom. But what does love got to do with it? You know what? <laughs> Thank you. Exactly. That's exactly what I was talking about. And I'm gonna start ordering food and just saying I cook it and see how you like that. It'll probably be better. <laughs> Girl, no! What? This is like your fourth, fifth time wanting to do this. I don't want to do this. Okay, what's wrong with that? Because you have too much stamina, we already did it, and I'm tired. Who complains about having sex with their girlfriend? I do when you do it eight times a day. You can do it like two or three more times, I believe in you. Why every time you wanna have sex, I gotta have sex? Because it's fun, and you're napping at 4 p.m. like some grandpa. I'm third, you know what? I'm getting a third opinion. Hey, what's up, man? Can you tell my girl every time she wanna have sex, I don't have to have sex? Don't I have the right to say no? No, you definitely have a right to say no. She can't take that away from you. But one thing that you have to understand is that if you don't provide it, she will get it from some other place. But mm -hmm. I got to go. Yo, baby. Get hello. Ew. Oh. It keeps me wanting to live and express myself. I love art. It saved my life. I just wake up in the morning and whatever really makes my heart skip a beat. Life is the inspiration. To be around other players who basically have the same aspirations, dreams, it helps you further yourself along. When I moved somewhere where it was a bunch of artists, it actually sparked my creativity even higher. You can't let the world dictate who you are. You can't let people dictate who you are. You have to know who you are. You can be a genius. It's hard to do it by yourself, but when you have other geniuses around you and y'all just tapping in together, y'all on the same frequencies, man, it just... Flow. Art is like my therapy and my communication with the world and however you can interpret humanity and express it in your art and that be the communication is a beautiful thing. In every artist's mind, there's a master. You know, the next thing might be your best thing. Never stop creating. Art liberates the soul. That means so much to me because art has literally saved 
my life. I feel free, I feel extremely liberated. I get to really explore every single part of who I am through my art with no filter and that is probably the best part of waking up every day.